Today we are looking at the ST Modular EFI DIY kit for a filter. So I actually built one of these things. Uh, it was actually my first DIY kit that I ever did. Uh, it was actually a great, I feel like, beginner kit. Very simple, very easy to do. Um, and a really low amount of HP space that it takes up for it. So it gives me a, a great little filter here low HP space, and an easy first DIY project. Going through the features of the filter, you have the cutoff knob up here, you have resonance right here. Uh, you have a two CV inputs, which is really cool, um, both of which control the cutoff here. And uh, so then you can attenuate both of those um, to, to kind of attenuate how much of the input is going through. Then you've got a low pass and a high pass switch, so it can switch from a low pass filter to a high pass filter. Um, great little switch there. And then uh, just have an input and an output. So very, very straightforward. So the thing I'll say about the EFI is that it is a great low cost DIY filter, but it is, you know, it's no Moog filter. It doesn't have that same kind of sound to it. Um, I know a lot of people are like think filters have certain kind of, you know, really distinct sounds. I would say this is a pretty mild filter. Um, I don't think that you get a ton of great effect out of the resonance. There's kind of a little sweet spot that I'll show in the jam here in a bit, but you're not going to still get that same kind of like Moog craziness thing going on. But you know, it's, it is a great filter for a great, a low cost DIY project. I'm happy I have it in my rig. I use it in almost every single patch. It's just like a very functional filter. Yes, there's probably better filters out there, but at the price point and to get you into DIY, I think it's a great one to have and you can never really have too many filters in your rig. So uh, I think you'll enjoy it and highly recommend it. All right, so I'm gonna do some quick playing here. Um, I've got the Manus Ateritas patched into this guy here. And we just got this low bass line. I'll just kind of sweep that up. So we're just totally just raising the filter up there. We'll bring up some resonance on it here. Again, you don't get any like crazy resonance sounds off with it. If you go too far, what I hate is it screeches. You can kind of, if you can get like right before the screech, there's sometimes a cool little sweet spot you can get to. No. It's, uh, the resonance just has some sweet spots. But again, overall, I just doesn't have, it's not this, not the same as like a crazy filter, but very functional. But where I think this thing gets cool, again, love the double CV input. That is super handy. So I'm just gonna, I've got a math from a CV running in here. Kind of just doing like 16th notes. And I got that kind of rhythmic, that's opening and closing of the filter in a rhythmic way. That's what I, getting a little, uh, little feedback there on that, that resonance. Again, so again, not always most, but again, if you get it right below there, you get a real nice sweet spot. I mean, there's with no filter here or no resonance, and that is with resonance. So you, you got to it adds a good amount to the sound. Uh, you know, it's, it's nice, making it that I don't know, like uh, bouncy. <laughs> Best adjective I, adjective I can think of. So I'm also gonna patch something in here. That's going into the second one here. So you see how that what I'm kind of doing. I'm just kind of putting another fill up on the back end of that sequence. So like literally, you know, we got just hitting the same note four times, putting it through a filter, and you you get yourself a pretty cool effect. I'm gonna tone it down a little. So again, really cool filter. Really dig it. Highly recommend it. Low cost for a DIY kit. You get some really cool sounds out of it and. Uh, Probably one of the best value filters I can get out there in just terms of cost and space it takes up. Uh, you will use this thing and you'll be happy you have it.
Yo, 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 yo.